Hi, I'm Heather Marie Vernon. This is my elimination video. That's my camera. It's not that fancy. I was eliminated and sorry it took me so long to get the video to you guys, but I actually totally made it too long. So I've truncated most of my thoughts. And I made some notes. <laughs> okay, first off, I really enjoyed being in the reality show. And it was a pretty awesome opportunity for me. And I was changed as a result um, of the experience, which was my initial intention. And I enjoyed meeting all of the contestants in... Facebook reality, which I thought was really interesting, playing around with e-identities, and I had the most fun doing that, and um, criticisms that were made of myself and others are valuable, and had I had, you know, certain qualifications as to why I did certain things, and um, I thought I'd tell you those. I thought, do I think it's, what did I think of the judge's other comments? Well, uh, first I thought that um, I just loved, you know, how how fun and witty Zoe's was, and um, I kind of like it that her environment is like in her home. I think that's interesting. I love it that Releve is not really showing us himself, and that that's a really interesting place to position oneself in relation to identity. I love that. I loved that Shelly's having a great time with her friends and, you know, she's getting collaborative with things and, like, that's really interesting to play with because I actually think the process of making art really better be fun and, you know, actually, I mean, if you look at the Situationist International, they actually, that's something that's really important to them is that leisure and play and work and integrating that. Love Daniel. Love authenticity. Love it. Love flirtatiousness. Total watchability, watchability. Um, I think I had, um, I think I have some criticisms of wanting to make things, so for this video, for this last video, wanting to make things so likable. Viral, in fact. Watchability. So much energy. Give it so much energy. I thought, you know, actually, I don't really know Gorgeous Tabs. Don't know her. I don't really know what she wants with this thing. Don't know. That's not clear. And that's interesting because then that means more possibilities are possible. Um, do when, when it started to become a little more junior high, like, I love Gorgeous Tess. I just love her. I love her. I don't know why. I want her to like me. And with extreme likability, I will do so many things to get that. I think I started to, to really question what is... What is this show? You know, I think there's some, there's a lot more possible within this architecture of uh, social, um, social interface and uh, e-realities and identities. I was most taken by Ryder Rips is um, criticism of me are, are you real, Heather? Um, I really felt that I should take my vlog down to the next level down tempo calm down make it kind of like an infomercial yeah make it even a little sleepy oh my god she's talking about politics and aesthetics again yuck social sculpture we don't want to know that it's teacher stuff but you know i felt that i had a certain um i was playing around with you know taking it down a notch especially if if i was you know, didn't want to go to Spammy Pam and didn't want to take it to, you know, um, where I was taking it too far. So maybe I took it too low. Where, did I deserve to go? Well, perhaps within that context. But one thing I wanted to bring up was that I felt there were a few things that maybe weren't so clear that, that were confusing. Like, what are the boundaries? You know, like, what, how far is too far? And, um, there were some certain ethics, like if two people are are um, eliminated, one, you know, one, the first session and then the second session, 
only one person's eliminated, well, we're not used to that. We didn't know that was going to happen. So then that was difficult for me, being that one person that was eliminated. Um, I also thought that there were certain demographics uh, of the contestants that really should just be looked at. Um, I also felt that... Um, you know, not just having one judge was an enough. I love this, the, the secret judge. I actually thought that that I feel like Anne and John Viev, a.k.a. Gorgeous Taps, are way too close to the, the project to make the, the final decisions that they, I think they needed a committee of people. I'm not saying that I shouldn't have gone. I'm just saying I think that that would have been best. Um, and I also feel like, um, Oh snap, I'm forgetting it in mid-sentence. Look at notes. Um, uh, um, I felt that it was a great experience and I loved being on the show. Um, so much more could be done. I thought, oh, right, eliminations with Skype technical difficulties. I felt like that should have been dealt with more um, succinctly because actually I did feel that things got personal. I did think that once you got everyone up there and you saw everyone's e-identity and you saw the energy of that and the exchange that was happening there, I felt that it wasn't just like, you know what, we can't do this right now. I thought it was, oh my God, this is really personal now and this is weird and intense and that's where I feel like more judges could have been invited there to supplement that experience or charge it more charge it more you know take it to the next level um it is personal you know you are gonna see people get hurt feelings you will have that expression on camera i i thought the conversations that we all had in our downtime like in the chats were amazing honestly i wish those were all wired or cataloged i felt that there should have been even more video confessionals asked of us um and i i thought that maybe the guy well, I thought that maybe some of the projects weren't as interesting as they could have been. Yeah. Yeah. So that was really maybe why I decided to um, exit on a soft note <laughs> and calm it all down. More energy, more energy, likability, viral, 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 Heather Marie, make it viral. And I was like, no... Maybe I don't belong here, but maybe I am changed. Thank you, gorgeous taps.